This is your League City Animal Shelter Volunteer Weekly Update. Community Outreach Adoption Events. We have the Taste of Texas Craft Beer and Wine Festival, which is this Saturday, November 7th from 2 p.m. to 6 p.m. We have the Ferguson Elementary Fall Festival, which is Saturday, November 14th, and that'll be from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. And we have the Moms of Galveston County Winter Festival, November 14th from 1 p.m. to 5 p.m. And of course, we have the Holiday in a Park, which is December 4th and the 5th, and the times are to be announced. At each of the events, we bring animals um, out to be adopted and hopefully find them forever home. Community Outreach Special Event. We have the College of the Mainland presentation, where we present the benefits of adopting and support their donation drive for the shelter. That'll be November 16th from 9.30 to 11 a.m. We also have the College of the Mainland doing a service day with us, a dog washing day on November 20th from 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Um, we have the Clear Lake High School Service Day, where we provide students with ways to help the shelter and present the volunteer program to recruit new volunteers. That will also be November 20th from 1 p.m. to 3 p.m. Of course, we have Autumn Leaves, where we visit the Memory Care Facility every fourth Tuesday of the month. The next visit will be Tuesday, November 24th from 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. And we have the Holiday in a Park Parade, and this year the theme is 1945 Christmas, and our theme is Dedication to Animals in Service. Um, we will be getting the trailer soon to start decorating and constructing it, so if you're interested, please email me and let me know. Volunteer training and meetings. Of course, we have open house. We have one next week, Tuesday, November 10th from 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. And the one after that will be Saturday, November 21st, 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. We also have our first um, annual volunteer meeting or quarterly meeting, which will be Monday, November 16th from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. That would be at the League City Civic Center. Um, that's less than two weeks away. So we about have half of the um, spots um, filled up so we still have about 15 more spots available um, sign up can be done on the volunteer page on the home page there's a link that you can click on and you can sign up to, um, to RSVP for the meeting for shelter news I know all of you have probably seen there's a new version of the volunteer page the main question that I've been getting on the on the page is how to sign up for shifts now so instead of a sign up tab there now is a tab for opportunities um, you can um, save your sign up and confirm and withdraw a sign up all on your own now um, all on the same page down at the bottom of the page so if you like to just sign up for something or confirm your shift or even actually cancel and say you can't sign up for it it can be all done on that one page. So check it out if you have any questions or if you like a one-on-one -on -one sit down so I can go over the new program with you. Um, email me and let me know. We also have a new campaign that we are going to participate in. It's called Hashtag Giving Tuesday. Um, basically, it's a global day to dedicate it to giving. Um, it's right after Black Friday and Cyber Monday, so it'll be Tuesday to December 1st. Um, campaign materials for the um, League City Animal Shelter fundraising will be coming soon. Most of the money that we um, fundraise will be going towards medical care for the animals. As you know, that, that is the one main thing that we always need help with. Um, so we would like to do a a big national campaign for us on trying to get um, money to help with the medical needs and help needed we do need pet smart helpers for this Saturday and Sunday Saturday at the League City um, pet smart and Sunday at the Baybrook pet smart we also need a lead for the um, pet smart this Sunday at the Baybrook we do have a lead for League City on Saturday but we do not have a lead for Baybrook on Sunday and um, we definitely need, since it's the last minute event, um, helpers for the Taste of Texas Craft Beer and Wine Festival um, for that Saturday to help with adoptions and hopefully promote the shelter as well. And for the volunteer spotlight, I'd like everybody to meet Art. Art has been officially volunteering for the Lake City Animal Shelter since August of 2015, although he started coming to the shelter, giving treats and socializing with the dogs way before that. Um, his first time actually volunteering was at our annual Paws and Claws Adopt-a-thon, and he still decided to volunteer with us after that craziness, so he is a trooper for that. Um, he's a police officer by day, a family man at night, and a canine companion volunteer on the weekends, so he's a very busy man, and we're so grateful to have him part of our team. Thank you so much, Art, for being so passionate and dedicated to the animals. Um, we couldn't get them all walked um, without you. So thank you, Art. 
And that's it, everybody, for the Volunteer Weekly Update. Um, we just want to thank everybody. And if you notice that Hermani did go to the DPS Academy for training, so let everybody wish her luck. And hopefully she'll be a narcotics and bomb sniffing dog. So thanks, everybody. See you next week.